let's come back and discuss this general topic uh, importance of salt bridge so we have already said in electrochemical cell to connect both the half cells that is your anodic half cell and cathodic half cell i require a salt bridge done the salt bridge we already represented with these double lines done so what actually is the function so when i have to write the first important function simple direct uh, nothing big logic so salt bridge is first important thing basically it is made up of either kcl or kno3 why this because kcl and kno3 when i see the transport number of them okay let us say kc salt uh, okay are used to prepare salt bridges okay so this the salt bridge which is there this u shaped thing which connects both the half cell done now why are we taking this because the k plus and cl minus transport number is same what is transport number now let us see is same why what is the transport number suppose if i take this this is a cation this is an anion now if i say transport number of the cation if i have to take okay let us take transport if i will not introduce that term now only transport number of cation is equal to <coughs> the charge of the cation by the total current so this is charge of cation when i calculate this divided by the total current in present in the half cell i get cation transport number now transport number of chloride ion the same thing charge of anion divided by total current now when this was calculated both the cation as well as anion the transport numbers were same so that's the reason the salt bridge is filled with kcl uh, in that particular, uh, the whole thing this is filled with kcl incorporated with kcl or kno3 done now after this thing now you have to remember what are the functions simple first important it will try to maintain the neutrality of the whole cell so electrical neutrality between both cells because there's flow of electrons from anode to cathode so its main function maintains this is the key word you have to remember electrical neutrality between cells electrical neutrality between cells half cells that done next important thing it will uh, when it's trying to maintain the electro uh, electron neutrality between both the half cells first important thing it has to allow the flow of current isn't it so it allows flow of current and when it's allowing the flow of current what is completed circuit is completed so i have picked up the important functions maintains electronic neutrality which is a keyword allows flow of current keyword completes the circuit keyword why kcl and or kno3 because the transport numbers are same that's it this is you can finish up your answer because if it is asked for two marks we have written one two three four points